hey guys I'm going to show you how to fix this problem on Windows 11 operating system at the first step simply right click here and select run then we need to type your MS config then click on OK before this just uh, right click on the taskbar then select task manager now click on run new task select browse button go to this PC open C drive then open Windows folder then find out system32 folder just double click on it to open it then search for cmd.exe file so here it is select it and click on open now check this box and click on ok now on this window we need to execute some commands type gp update and hit enter so this will take some time to complete the process we need to wait for it it will take just uh, six to seven seconds to complete this command once done we need to type in chkdsk space c colon slash f and hit enter type y and hit enter once done type exit to close the command prompt window and then close this one then just go to search bar open registry editor you can simply type here r e registry editor click here to open it select s now expand hk local machine from here then expand system then expand control set 001 folder then expand services folder then from here we need to find out ndu folder so here it is just select it then on the right side right click on start select modify and change the value data as to 4 ok then click on ok again go back to hk local machine then open system folder then expand current control set now expand control folder then expand session manager so just scroll down and here you will get in session manager simply expand it then from here we need to select memory management just expand it now just select it on the right side here you will get clear page file at shutdown simply right click on it and select modify change the value data as one then click on ok now close all windows one by one after that we need to select services on the system configuration window check this box and select all these services click on disable all then click on apply and then select ok here we need to restart our system so don't forget to like the video and please do subscribe just restart your system and your problem will be solved and you are good to go